of planning in South Burlington have started to yield some results as a ribbon cutting ceremony for the Garden Street Apartments was held on Monday. City Council President Helen Reilly called it another step in the culmination of a long dream city center and city manager Kevin Dorn said there's other aspects that further its importance in the city. Some of these apartments are even going to uh, be four bedroom apartments. So we're talking about affordable housing even for families of that size. So it's a great new product, a great new development for Champlain Housing Trust, but it's also great for South Burlington and City Center. Just in the time city leaders spent at the ribbon cutting, really said the benefits were clear and hopes it's a sign of what's to come once the building fills up. About 10 children came off the buses and were running happily, yelling and laughing into the building to their new home. A woman came up to me afterwards and wanted to thank the city council and the city for making this possible because she had been homeless and she now had a home. As plans for a new library, city hall and senior center come to fruition, 2020 is shaping up to be a pivotal year for the city center project. The new garden apartments will be fully leased up shortly. Construction is beginning on the connection of Garden Street, so there are many things going on on the public side. On the private side, the developers are coming forward with an application to build a large housing uh, project that will be market rate uh, directly behind healthy living. Now they're planning to have the city center built and occupied by summer of 2021. You obviously heard there a lot of the infrastructure work going into that this year. Now people started moving into these apartments behind me last month and we are told they're in high demand. Now prices are as low as $713 a month for a one bedroom apartment and $1230 a month for a four bedroom and that rent includes heat and hot water. There's also two and three bedroom units inside the building. Live from South Burlington, Devin Bates, Local 44 News.